Keep it moving, keep it moving. Well done. We're here with Coach Parsons post Thorns training. Coach, I was impressed obviously with many things, but a couple of things that stood out to me was the pace and the purpose of the session. And right here you have four goals. You had five versus five plus one. What were you looking for? They've just come back from two days off. We wanted to plant the seed of, of wanting to enjoy the ball and we're going to have to switch it against the team we're coming up against. They'll, they'll try and lock us into one side and we're going to have to get across that pressure. And we okay. wanted to, to give them a taste of that on this re-entry while also let them enjoy being back. So if we get into the session, I'm your player here. Where do you want me? Head out towards, be, be a left back. I've heard that you've got <laughs> a, a left foot that needs some work. <laughs> I've never had this left foot before. You might need to do technique work with me first. The key thing was, if we can't go forward, how do we get across the field? Okay. If you can go forward with your first touch and break lines and create, fantastic. But what if you can't, and we are focused on me today, whoever this player was, we wanted to create space for me to get the ball across, okay. or by moving, create space for a center mid. So by dropping into you with pressure and then dropping back, checking my shoulder, everyone else will react from me. Yeah. If they see me doing this, everyone else will start opening up knowing I'm going to try and get across the pitch. And if I play to you and I drop this way and you can't play me, you now have more space to get through the field there. One little thing I noticed there, the first ball you played me running onto, the second one you played to me, that's the, perhaps the recognition from you, what I have on. Yeah, and we got into that later on in the session and you, and you, you, see, you see the players, especially the top players, communicate with their pass. If I know you've got that space, I'm going to play to that foot. If I know you're, you're inviting pressure, I'll play to this side so you suck them further. Yeah. And when you play one touch, now I might be able to play to a higher player right. that, where the space was that you pulled someone from. Just know something you've done there automatically. You've had a quick look. Even when you pass it to me, you already looked and you scanned. Well, if I could do it a bit quicker, then I probably wouldn't be coaching. I might be out there with you <laughs> scoring some goals. Well done! Great example of you enjoying the ball while trying to score goals. Finally, the personality, instructions, enjoy the footballs, what I kept hearing, what's that all about? Yeah, well, two things. I think we've got a lot of players that love the ball, a lot of the players that love to move the ball. So we wanted to be able to get into areas that we know create great chances for us. It wasn't about how we get there, and it wasn't, it wasn't complex or there wasn't multiple solutions. There was one or two ideas that we know gives us a high percentage chance of getting there, it gives us a, a big chance of creating the great chances. That's terrific. As you can see, pace, personality, purpose, all a part of the Mark Parsons session.